God's time is always the best when it comes to every situation. He knows when you are ready to take on a phase of life. The Bible says that before you were formed, He knew you. That means that before you were formed, God already knows the best for you and, in turn, knows what you need exactly when you need it. God wants you to be prepared in every situation and that is why He makes sure you are ready before you go into new things. Preparation comes before every action. God also hides you first because He wants the best to come out of you before you move to this phase of life. Do not be surprised if God hides you and do not be discouraged when He does. We serve a God who hides His servants and while they are hidden, He works in them so that later and with greater power, He may work through them. He wants you to become spiritually mature when He hides you. A person who is not spiritually mature could easily fall for looks when they are making choices. Because of this, God makes you realize how looks do not necessarily matter when you are about to choose the right person. Just like God does not judge based on outward appearance, He also wants you to choose someone not based on looks. God does not see the things the way we see them, but He looks at the bigger picture, which is the future. That is what He also wants us as His children to be paying attention to. You have to reach the stage where you value a person's character by their substance and spiritual values and not just how they present themselves. To be able to do this, you have to be spiritually discerning. If Samuel in the Bible had anointed a king based on just how they looked, he would never have discovered David. He was discerning to listen to the thoughts of God accurately and find the right person. That is the same way that you are to approach the situation. You are not doing this alone, but with the help of God. You should not be overtaken by your fleshy feelings, but look at the bigger picture. Your love is not to be based on feelings anymore. It is a decision that comes with feelings when it is the right person. God wants to establish by hiding you that just because a person seems like the right one does not mean they are the right one. You should not rush into all these things anymore but wait for the leading of the Spirit. When God has fully established this, He exposes you because He now sees you as ready. When God is hiding you, He gives you all sorts of things to make you ready. One such is making you learn to pray for this kind of thing. Some people find it hard to pray for their spouses. They see it as something that does not require prayers because they feel once they see the person, they will get the feeling that he's the right one. Praying for the right person means acknowledging that you need wisdom and guidance from God in choosing a partner. He wants you to keep him in the picture when he is making all these decisions. Without wisdom, you can end up in a bad relationship that would only cause you pain. So it is best to ask God for discernment right from the start through consistent prayers. If you make this mistake, it could be the one that you would regret for the rest of your life because you would not be able to get out of it. When it is looking you are not out but shielded, then you should know there is something that God wants to establish in you first. And how to know that is through prayer. You have to go to Him and keep asking what it is that He wants you to do. Which areas He has seen you need development is what you should be praying about. When He reveals this to you, then you take a step further and start asking Him for guidance on how He wants you to get better. You cannot do it on your own. You have to wait for Him to take over for you. Surrender all to Him and let Him do this mighty work in you. This period of being hidden might be a very hard one because you could be at a marriageable age. In this period of waiting, you have to know that you are not alone. God is there with you every step of the way. 
everything that takes a longer time to be ready is always something much more precious than the ton. See yourself as someone very special because God is taking His time with you and wants it to be perfect for you in every way. God wants the best for you, and that is why He is hiding and shielding you. Never make the mistake of blaming God and turning your back on Him because of how everything might be looking. But what you should do is to cling more to Him. God loves you and cares about you, and He only wants the best for you. When you turn away, you are only doing yourself bad because then you will be exposed to the devil to push you to make the wrong decision. You have to understand that God's love surpasses all and He cares for you, never to leave you stranded. It may be your spouse that God might be training because He knows that if He reveals you to yourselves, a grave mistake might be made or something will happen that will break the relationship at that moment. You have to learn to leave everything to God and let Him do what is best for you. Trust Him for He cares for you. The reason God is hiding you now could be because He knows you are not yet ready to handle such a great step. This is God's way of shielding and protecting you because He does not want you to make any mistake that might jeopardize His will for you. This is how He can control the situation to make sure you can handle it in the future. A distinct reason why God is hiding you from the right person until it's the right time could be because He wants your faith and relationship with Him to be established. Some people have the concept that once they find the person they will get married to and he or she is a godly person, they will help him or her to grow in God. This is a voidable thought because a soldier prepares before going into battle and not when he is in the middle of the battle. You should be able to grow yourself spiritually and strengthen your relationship with God before going into marriage or relationship because when fire meets fire, it is a stronger combination. He is hiding you because a meaningful relationship that you are to establish first is one with Him. God is the one who will lead you and guide you to make the right choices. He's also the one that will help you to be able to handle everything that may come along the way in the relationship. You have to know God better because your relationship with Him will determine how submissive you are to Him. You are to listen to Him and also you will be sensitive enough to know His will for you.